Yo, what is up, guys? It's Maso Twenty Ten, and today we are continuing with our final part of Star Wars Rebels. Today we have season four, episode thirteen. No, episode twelve, I think. Twelve or thirteen. Whatever, well, whatever. Wolves and a door. I have no idea what to expect here. Uh, I honestly don't know what to think about Rebels anymore. I know it's cool, but I have honestly no idea what is going on. I hope we get to know what the wolves are now, and hopefully find out more about the son, the daughter, and the father. You ready? Let's do this. Oh god. Ah, oh, that's adorable. <laughs> All right, Ezra. Have our attention. Now explain what's going on. This stone came from the Jedi Temple here on Lothal. Far to the north, how did it get here? The Lothwolves gave it to me. They think the Empire is doing something terrible there. Okay, <laughs> wait. They think. What did they talk to you? Yeah. Uh, just the one. I wish they told you what these symbols mean. I agree. We have to go. I don't want the Empire putting their hands all over the temple. So let's stop them. Okay, then. Yeah! There's just Fuck the Empire! Them. As Hera said, the temple is far to the north, and. We don't have a ship. I can get us there. There come the wolves. Cool. Take us. Yeah. I love those wolves. They're so cool. <laughs> Are these things faster than speeders? Well, they got us here in the first place. I guess they can get us to the temple as well. I'm just, you know, more comfortable with speeders. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, hello. My name is Zeb. <laughs> Zeb? Those ones don't talk. How do you know? It talks. <laughs> it sighs. Everyone ready? Here we go. I don't think Harris. I don't think Harris ever done that before. I don't think I've ever seen Hera put a goggles down before. <laughs> oh, Cho just got bit. That just that just that really sped up then. Wait, are they going into the ground or something? Whoa! Oh, that was weird. You want to run? You don't know us. And I don't want to. I lost my way for a long time. But now, <laughs> I have a chance to change things. We have hope. Hope that things can get what better. What the fuck is going on? And they will. Okay, let, ooh, hang on, let's see what the Empire's done. Whoa! Wait. No. This is no military operation. What are they searching for? Let me take a look. Artifacts? Wait. The doors, they're both gone. And it looks like one of them has been cut right off the surface. Is this really the temple? Get away from there at once! I 
I've said it before. None of you are to touch the artifacts. The tiniest blemish could erase evidence, which is critical to understanding the gateway. Gateway? I mean, yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Minister, Coruscant is contacting you. Who is this guy? This conduct reflects poorly on you, Commander. Yes, Minister. Alright, you two. Numbers and clearance codes. Now! You don't need our numbers and clearance. I don't need your numbers <laughs> and clearance. Death Troop is a weak minded. All about this. Hey, he's a type of scholar? Chopper, I need you to reroute the incoming Imperial transmission. We have recently made some remarkable discoveries, my Emperor. We must discover the secrets of the temple. For you, <laughs> our enemies move against us. Oh! Oh! God. Oh God! No! So, is that is that actually the actor that you played the Emperor? What's his name? Is Something. Is that Ian McGregor? I think that is. Oh, Sabine and Ezra's reaction to that voice. Oh, it was beautiful. We have reached the roots of the temple and found some fascinating work. The symbols and iconography are some of a report I discovered in the Jedi Archive. Yeah, there they are. The Mortis Gods. Yes. They are key to unlocking the temple. I am sure of it. There has been a great disturbance in the Force. The death of Kanan Jarvis has altered the fate of Lothal. Though how, I cannot say. Perhaps access to the temple will provide some clarity, my lord. We must seize the power within. A conduit between the living and the dead. Proceed, Minister Hyden. Hera, did you hear? What should we do? I don't like it. With the Emperor involved, it's too dangerous. We should fall back. No. Because of the Emperor, we have to get involved. We can't let him enter the temple. Ah, uh, God, that was so cool! Time. Hera. Remember why we came. So, a, a bridge between life and death? That's, oh god! Oh, that was cool. Game into the force, ghost! Ha! Uh, move the drill into first position. Everyone double shifts through the night. Mind your priority assignments and stay within your designated areas. Turn the floodlights on. You ever seen anything like this before? Nope. But this temple is always full of surprises. Lord Hayden, we have discovered more symbols. Show me. Can you make anything out of it? Mm, I think so. <sighs> very old. Very intricate. Does any of this mean anything to you? Daughter? Father? Son! Haha! <laughs> So weird seeing those again. Well, I've seen a bird like that before. Whenever Ahsoka visited us on Adalon, it was always nearby. I knew they were connected. And look, both wolves. Whoa!
Push these things. Get down! LS-515, why aren't you on patrol? I thought I saw something moving over here. This is all very irregular. We're gonna have to call it in. If you do that, I'll be late for my assignment. Like you said, we're just following protocol. Hurry up, Ezra. 515. Affirmative. Copy that. Over. I don't have time for this. Operation says you and LS-412 deviated from your patrol route and never finished the perimeter sweep. Let's go over to Operations and straighten this out. Great. Now we're both gonna have to file a report. Ah. Listen. Kanan said to listen. Probably nobody's seeing this. Whoa! That that painting's moving. Oh god! Oh, this is weird. But it's so cool. What the fuck is going on? Move. At least I mean, he's going to notice it at least. Uh, what have we here? Minister, we're bringing this trooper in for processing. There seems to be a discrepancy. Indeed. Restrain her. Lock down the perimeter. Order all units to report in. We have an imposter loose on sight. Yeah, now it's not a fan out. Oh, go! Haha! <laughs> oh, it froze. Oh, come on! You cannot end it like that! Oh, that is bu- Oh, wait. No, it's okay. No, it's okay. It's okay. The next one is already out. Yep, see, it's right there. A war, be a war between- A world between- A world between worlds! But that's gonna have to wait until- I hate this stupid but, you know what? That's gonna have to wait because I need to edit this first. Mm. Okay. So, Master 2010, if I'm replying to it, or Act 2010, put me in the comments down below. Wait, am I doing this right now? I'm not explaining a little bit first. Okay, all I will say is that is Ian McGregor. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that name wrong, but oh my god. Uh, oh, that's not, that's not Sam Whitworth. That is Ian McGregor. Oh, I love it. I love that. And, oh, Sabine and Ezra's reaction to hearing his voice was perfect. Like, 
Oh my god, it's the Emperor. Oh my god, oh my god, I, I'm, I'm fucking, I'm chuffed about that. Oh, I cannot wait, I'm gonna do this episode like right now. Okay, it's been Master 2010, if you want to play with it, or react 2010, put in the comments down below. I will see you in the next episode of this. Please like, subscribe, see ya!